Hi kids! Today we will learn what are decimals or how to convert fractions into decimals. So let's get started. What fraction of this figure is shaded? Figure is divided into 10 equal parts and one out of 10 equal parts is shaded. So, one-tenth of the figure is shaded. Now we will learn how to convert a fraction number into a decimal number. First of all, let's see what are decimal numbers. Decimal number is another way of representing a fraction by showing part of the whole, by placing it on the right side of a period, like 0 0.1. Here, 0 0.1 represents one part out of 10 parts. It is one by 10. So we can say one by 10 or 0.1, part of this figure is shaded. So, 1 by 10 equals 0.1, or 1 tenth. Let's take more example. What part of this figure is shaded? Here, three parts out of 10 are shaded. In fractions, we say that 3 by 10 of the figure is shaded. In decimals, we say 0 0.3 or 3 tenths part of the figure is shaded. Let's take another example. What portion of the figure having two circles is shaded? Here, one hole is shaded. And in another circle, three out of 10 parts are shaded. So in fractions, we can represent it as a mixed number, written like this. Here, one represents a whole, and three by 10 represents the fraction portion. In decimals, we can write it like this. Here, one represents the whole, and 0.3 represents the three parts of a whole. What fraction of this figure is shaded? Four parts out of 10 are shaded. So, in fractions, we will represent it as 4 by 10. And in decimals, we can write it as 0.4 or 4 tenths. Let's take another example. What fraction of this figure is shaded? Five parts out of 10 parts are shaded. So, in fractions, we write it as 5 by 10. And in decimals, we write it as 0.5 or 5 tenths. Now, let's take another example. What portion of the figure having two rectangles is shaded here? Here, one whole rectangle is shaded. And in another rectangle, six out of 10 parts are shaded. So in fractions, we can represent it as a mixed number, written like this. Here, one represents a whole, and six by 10 represents the fraction portion. We can name it as one and six tenths. Where and separates the whole number and the fraction number. 
In decimals, we can write it like this. Here, one represents the whole and 0.6 represents six parts of the whole. And we read decimal numbers as one and six tenths. Here, and represents the decimals and also separates the whole number and the fraction number. Good. So kids, today we have learned what are decimal numbers. Now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.